Welcome to Top Solid 7. In this video, we're just going to talk about speed for a second. To begin with, I want to show you what kind of computer I'm running. So if I go to Properties here, uh, it's nothing special. It is an Alienware computer, but to be honest, it's an Alienware computer that I picked up at Best Buy for about $1,500. Uh, it's an i7 processor, 920, which is a 2.67 gigahertz processor. There's 9 gigs of RAM. Obviously, it's Windows 7, 64-bit. Um, graphics card wise it is a uh, standard GeForce graphics card uh, it's nothing special it's a gaming card in fact okay so what I want to show you here is this first I'm gonna go here and we're gonna go find some information about this part real fast and actually to do that I want to open up the original design file for this so I'm gonna go to my parts here and we want the core block, I believe. Yes. Okay. So here is the actual core block design that we're gonna, that we're machining. Okay. And what we want to do is we want to find out some information about this block. So, for example, if I go to, uh, I believe information. Up. Oh, excuse me. We want analysis. Uh, it's a solid. It's one body. There are four thousand three hundred and fifty-four faces. Okay, uh, over 1,100 edges, so forth and so on. Uh, basically, if we zoom up on this, you're going to see that there's a lot of geometry. Okay, and while it's not complex, uh, in today's world of CAD CAM, complex really isn't the problem. It's number of faces to calculate toolpath on. Okay, so without further ado, let's go do some fun. So here, we're back in CAM, and what I'm going to do is right mouse button click and say I'd like to create a finishing. Uh, here, I'm going to leave it at 8 tenths uh, computing tolerance and roughly an 8 tenths scallopite. Uh, the only thing I'm going to do is go pick a tool. Here, we'll choose a uh, half inch ball end mill. Why not? There we go. And now I'm going to add a boundary curve. You don't really need to for this test, but that's okay. I'm just going to trim it to this boundary curve here. Okay. And like that, we're just going to accept the rest of the defaults. So I'm going to hide this, but before I actually tell it to calculate, I'm going to start my task manager. And if you're familiar with i7 processors, there's eight processing threads. Okay, so watch what happens. I'm going to validate and watch over here. So here, it's going to fire up here in a sec. It's beginning its calculation. And like that, we're now pegging all eight processing threads. This is a big part, by the way. You can see this is uh, minus 17 inches over here to 17 inches over there, 15, 15. It's a big part, lots of faces. So the calculation is done. Now it's just encoding it, which is translating it into our language. And now we're going to display the simulation. So in just a matter of a few seconds, on over 4,000 faces, we have created our toolpath. And here you see the simulation. We can kick out of this real fast. And let's actually go ahead and kick out of this and just turn it on to show you how nice that tool, this toolpath looks. If we zoom up, you can see it's a beautiful toolpath, and it happened in just a few seconds over something so big and with so many faces. I hope you enjoyed this sample of Top Solid Cam 7, and I hope you download the trial and check it out for yourself.